Hey friends, this is Wendy with Love and Stampin'. I am so excited that you're here with me today. I have 52, that's right, 52, 52 amazing cards to show you today. These cards all came from a card swap. So basically, I make a certain amount of cards using specific stamp sets, I mail them out, and then I receive cards back. This particular swap I participate in is one that I was invited to a few years back, and I've continued to participate in it. So if you're interested in participating in card swaps, you can go on Facebook and search card swap groups. Or uh, if you are a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, you may find some within um, your demonstrator groups, things like that. But this one in particular is not one that I can share a link to because it's an invite only. So we're going to start out and I'm going to show you the first 11. These 11 cards were made using brand new bundles from the January through April mini catalog, or as I like to call it, the spring catalog. So we'll start with this one right here. So stinking cute. And this was made by Christine Bertram. And I just think it is so beautiful. One of the requirements of our card swaps is that you have to do something on the inside of the card. So I think that that's really fun. This one is the winner for my very favorite card in this grouping. Um, I absolutely love this card. The brilliance of creating kind of like a shadow. So this person, um, it was made by Carissa. She went ahead and die cut it twice. So back behind here is a shadow and then there's this and she embossed this part. She did embossing down here. It's just stunning. I mean, I can't say enough for this card. And then the inside is additionally as amazing. So this card wins for me in this particular grouping of just absolutely gorgeous. And I love how she added rhinestones to the eyes of the skull and crossbones. Here is another super cute card. This is the um, Easter bundle with that cute little bunny punch. And then um, they fussy cut one of the bunnies. And then the inside just has a strip of beautiful paper. This one is super cute. This is using that floral frame. I can't remember the name of this bundle, but super cute. And happy St. Patrick's. This particular bundle, the last time I checked, is on back order or not orderable for now. I knew that that would happen. I, I knew this bundle would go really quick. They are going to have more come back into stock, so just stay um, waiting for that. And it says, sending luck and love, happy St. Patrick's Day. And I just think it is adorable. This was made by Sarah Simon. This one is beautiful. This is made by my very one and only Miss Sandra Hernandez. She is actually part of the Lovely Stampers team, so she's part of my team. And I love this card. This is gorgeous. I love all the monochromatic and with the touches of gold. And she splattered. Uh, looks like she did splatter embossing. It's just stunning. And I love this bow that she did. This card is gorgeous. This is probably my second favorite. Uh, sorry, Sandra, just being honest. <laughs> this one is gorgeous as well. I love this thistle set. This is a fun bundle and there's some splattering on here as well. And then really beautiful on the inside. This is made by Lori Krause. The only thing I would say on this card is the embossing here is beautiful, but it's a little hard to read. So I might emboss that in white instead of gold. But other than that, I think it's a gorgeous card. This card is by Wendy Lee, and this is a right up my alley. Uh, it's got all the things I love, black, white, and bright colors, and graphic design. So this one really hits it home for me. I love this card. Another beautiful card. Love the fun fold and this gorgeous border technique here. You have a heart of gold. This is using the, this is by Kathy Miller and it's using the Marigold bundle, super cute. This one is by Jeanette Swain and I just think it is gorgeous. Um, absolutely beautifully done. So much intricate die cutting here, layered beautifully. The bird is colored, gorgeous. Always thinking of you, it's just stunning. Love that card. 
This one is a sympathy card by Miss Sandy Carlson. It is done very well, sending hope and peace. And it's a with sympathy. I actually think I'm going to be using this card very soon. Uh, we have a, a team member who recently lost her son. And I think I'm going to go ahead and send her this card because it's just beautiful. All right. So there is the first grouping of 11. Now we're going to look at the cards that use an a entire suite of products. So... For this, there will be two cards in every suite. So this is that, I believe this is the Regency Park. I probably should have looked these up beforehand. All the wonderful things you do. Thank you. Or thanks for. And this says, let's celebrate you. And then happy birthday. Super cute cards. And then this uses that new, really cool motorcycle set ride on it's your birthday and then there's this cool dsp on the inside this one just really knocks it out of the park beautiful chrome and this bike the bicycle the motorcycle is beautifully done really pretty these are by tammy sokolik i think is how i say it classic authentic since forever so cool i love that this is pink and it's just super fun i don't know any women um, besides my friend Dawn who ride motorcycles. <coughs> so I'm um, not sure who to give this to, but um, maybe it'll just go in my collection. Okay, then we have that new desert suite, which I think is gorgeous. I absolutely love it. I haven't got to use it yet, but I love it. And this card opens like this. Super fun. This, these, both of these are by Christine Bertram and they are using the exact same suite of products. Whenever we do card swaps that use a suite of products, we have to use every element of the suite. That's why you are seeing these cards have embellishments, they have ribbon, they have designer paper, they have the die cuts. It's because part of this is to use all the parts and pieces. This is by, by Deb Norman, gorgeous cards. Both are very beautiful. I absolutely love this one. It's kind of like a little bouquet. And I gotta be honest, this is not a stamp set or punch that I own, but this is kind of making me want to get that set. This is the Oh Happy Day. These are by my sweet Sandra and they are beautiful. She did such a good job. So some fun embossing, stamping on the inside, beautiful ribbon here. She just did a beautiful job on both of these. I love this, how it's layered with the vellum. So, so good. This is your very own lady stamper here, Miss Wendy. These are mine. These are using the Enjoy the Journey Suite. And how crazy, how different are these, right? They're totally different looks and exactly from the same suite. So I thought that was a lot of fun. And then we've got this gorgeous two-tone floral or flora. This just comes out. There's a little pocket here. I definitely am going to case this because I think it is adorable to just have this kind of like little, I don't know, note card. And then it opens up like so. So I think this is just Fantastic. I love this card. So I'm going to be casing that for sure. And then we have this one. And it's with deepest sympathy. We always need a, a handful of sympathy cards around, right? And I don't like making sympathy cards. So I'm always happy when I get them in a swap so that I can just have them on hand. You are a pearl, rare and precious. And this is just a beautiful card done with this suite. And then this says Heartfelt Sympathy. These are by Jeanette Swain. And again, super happy to have some sympathy cards that I didn't have to create. So those are the cards. Those were 16 cards using brand new sweets from Stampin' Up. All right, these use all of our celebration products. So it doesn't necessarily mean the entire card is made with celebration products. It just means that an element of the card is. So the first card on top is my card. If you followed my channel for any length of time, you've actually already seen a video on me making this card. 
and it uses that thanks a bunch stamp set with the carrots super cute love it this one uses one of the stamp sets the designer paper and this is by Judy Garza this one uses the beautiful one of those beautiful free stamp sets I can't remember the name of all the stamp sets this is from J so cute another one it's actually funny this is by I think two different people and they're very similar this one didn't have a name oh you know what it might have been Jeanette this might have been Jeanette Swain's okay and then we have this one I just recently made a card that opens like this which I think is kind of funny um, and this is by Lori Krauss it uses that designer series paper that is free this uses the little owl and dandy designs both free celebration papers this is by Kathy Miller this one is sending happy thoughts and this is by Katherine Anderson and it uses that beautiful stamp set that is free this one uses the designer series paper that's free in the catalog and I think this is brilliant there is literally almost no stamping on this at all these are all just die cut or fussy cut from the designer series paper to make an entire scene and then from all of us I think this is brilliant thinking happy thoughts of you and there was no name with this one so I'm not sure who did that there's another beautiful card and this one is an easel card so it pops up like that it says may the good you do come back to you and then it says thank you this is by Christine Bertram I love this one this one wins this is my favorite one in this grouping um, I just it appeals to all the things windy um, it has the co beautiful colors this is by Lori Mueller um, yeah everything about it. it has a nice focal point I, it's just beautiful I love it and this one thank you for your kindness another one of those fun folds this is by Carissa beautiful sending happy thoughts for a very happy birthday a z fold card this one is just that beautiful i think this is the dandy designs and this is that other stamp set that's free with an order you are easy to love for a very happy birthday and then this one says courage is being really scared and doing it anyway and this is by jennifer hampshire and I love what she did with this designer series paper I will admit this is my very least favorite designer series paper <laughs> and so um, I'm very impressed that she made this card this way because I think it's stunning and I never would have thought to cut this designer paper up this way and use it this way but it's absolutely gorgeous so super happy to have this card so it just says you've got this and then it's this is by Wendy Lee which doesn't surprise me because I always love Wendy Lee's cards okay so those are our celebration and now we have one more grouping which are our single stamp sets so these were just single stamp sets in the catalog that don't necessarily have dies that people created something with this one is my very favorite of this grouping because it has a scene here that is gorgeous um, this is done by Carissa and she outdid herself uh, the colors in this everything about it is just beautiful there's no one better than you and it's this really cool fun fold and I will be casing this I've never done this fun fold so I'm excited for that smiles across the miles every day with you is another adventure very very beautiful card this is by Christine it's the best day because it's your birthday and this is gorgeous they used the designer series paper by Lori Mueller here on each side and die cut it over a layer is what I'm thinking happened is that two pieces yeah it is it's two pieces of DSP glued on and then she die cut it out beautiful another gorgeous stamp set no love knows no boundaries difficult roads bring you to beautiful destinations this is by Lori Krauss and I have to tell you this image here reminds me of the TV show Yellowstone I don't know kind of the opening scene of Yellowstone how it has anyways that's what it made me think of 
gorgeous stamp set, gorgeous card. Uh, you matter to so many. And this is just beautifully done. That was by Jeanette Swain. Another super, super cute card. Hope you are surrounded by friends on your birthday. And this is by Tammy. Very beautiful. I love hanging out with you. Super cute. Very simple. Love this card by Wendy Lee. I just can't tell you what a gift it is to call you my friend. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous card by Sandy Carlson. I love Miss Sandy Carlson. Okay, thinking of you, and then it says with comfort and love. And this is by Jennifer Hampshire. Really cool card. Love this, holy guacamole, it's your birthday. And there's guacamole and chips and a little avocado with a hat. Happy birthday, Sarah Simon, so cute. Love the way this one turned out. And then this one is made by yours truly. I actually did a video on how to make this card um, and it was provided in uh, a class. So anyway, that's it. Okay, that is all of our cards, my friends. That is 52 card samples of absolute brilliance. Um, if you see something here that you want me to show you how to make other than these two, cause they're on my list, I'm setting them aside. Um, let me know. And I would certainly work on duplicating it for you. So many ideas, so many fun cards. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next card making video. Bye-bye.